I have Huawei Mate 9 Pro and let me show you how to use secret codes on the following device. So at the very beginning let's start by using our home screen. Let's open the phone's dialer and let me enter the service menu, so the project menu in the Huawei. So let's enter the following code, asterisk hash, asterisk hash, 284679, hash asterisk, hash asterisk. As you can see the project menu just pops up. So here you can navigate by tapping appropriate options. You can choose the background settings when you can make it background debug open. You can change USB port settings. You may also use the AP lock settings and make it open and set UI theme color. Alright, let's go back. Let's open the veneer information. Here you can have access to a couple of useful data. For example, the version info, the manufacturer info, AP version, CP version, kernel version, bootloader version and other stuff. Let's go back. You can also see the manufacturer information right here. You may read the other info such as the run mode, the audio parameter and also you can verify key if you would like to. Let's go back. Now let's open network information query here. You've got two very interesting things. Things the sorry the sim log info right here. So you can check your sim log status. In my case, sim log is deactive. You can also see the vendor country info. In my case, for example, the country is from Europe. So tap close. Let's go back, and you can try to upgrade your device by using the software upgrade from the SD card. You may also here accomplish the hard reset operation by choosing Restore Factory, but let's just be careful with that one because of course this operation will erase all your data. And you may also see the battery charge information right here, the battery level and the battery temperature. Use the back key to quit the project menu, and now let's open the. Android test mode, so let's use the asterisk hash, asterisk hash, 6130, hash asterisk, hash asterisk. The testing menu just pops up. Here you can see the phone information from the first SIM card, for example. Here we've got the email number, phone number, current network, signal strength, the call status. You can run a ping test or you can use more key in order to view SIM address book, view fixed dialing numbers, view service dialing numbers, get PDP list or just enable data connection. Alright, let's use the back key a couple of times, let me quit the phone info. Now let's open the usage statistics and here we've got the list of all applications and you can read the last time used and usage time. Very interesting and useful thing. You can also use the Wi-Fi information. Here we've got the Wi-Fi API when you can disable network, disconnect network, enable network, get configured networks or get connection info. You may also use the Wi-Fi config and see the configured networks from your device or you may use the Wi-Fi status to read the statistics about your Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi, you can refresh or stats or run a ping test. Alright, let's go back to quit the Android testing menu and this time let me open the about phone information. Let's enter the asterisk hash, asterisk hash, 0000, zero, 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 hash asterisk, hash asterisk. And about phone just pops up, here you've got access to build number, hardware version, the email number and other stuff as well. Let's go back. Now it's time to open the calendar menu, so let's use asterisk hash, asterisk hash, 225, hash asterisk, hash asterisk. As you can see the calendar mode just pops up. You can read the events from your country, from your phone, from your Gmail account and other stuff as well. Now let me open the Google Play service, so let's use asterisk hash, asterisk hash, 426, hash asterisk, hash asterisk. The Google Play service just pops up, so you can read all of these things right here, such as the ping, connect, disconnect or events. Alright, let's go back. And you can also open the email mode by using asterisk hash, 06 hash, and the email information and other stuff such as the serial number pops up in front of you. Tab OK to close this. Let me quit the fonts dialer and that's it. Everything went well. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe our channel and leave thumbs up under the video.